Today, in Monroe County Court, the sexual abuse trial against Joe Flowers began. Flowers is the pastor at Walk of Life Christian Center and is accused of sexually abusing a 12-year-old who attended his church. 13 Lambs' Angela Hong was in court today. She's live now in our newsroom with more on what happened today. Angela? Ginny, the boy described in graphic detail how Flowers would allegedly molest him in the room Flowers called the bonus room and also in the shower. The boy said several boys from the church would also spend the night at Flowers' house. Tonight, we spoke to the boy's relative about what it was like to watch the young boy face his alleged abuser. He, he went up there. He, um, he, did pretty, he did fairly good. He did fairly well, and I'm proud of him. Proud of his 12-year-old relative who took the stand on Wednesday to describe how this man, Bishop Joe Flowers, allegedly sexually abused him over a three-year period. I mean, no child should have to go through this. You know, I mean, once it was done, then there was a, a period of time where he could be more open and everything. Now to come back in here and relive all of this stuff again, you know, it's, to him, it's like it just happened yesterday. We have concealed Joel's face and full name to protect the identity of the boy. On the stand, the boy said his pastor, Joe Flowers, touched his genitals and sodomized him. The alleged abuse occurred when his mom was at work and when no one else was in the room. The boy and his mom had also lived at the Flowers residence for a period of time. The family says Flowers betrayed everyone's trust. He abused his right. I, I feel as though that he should get the maximum of whatever this, this, this can get him. Today was the first and last time the alleged victim would take the stand. It's um, obviously a difficult task for a brave boy. And the family says effects of the alleged abuse is something the boy will always have to live with. You're taking away their choices to be a man or to be a woman. What, you're, you're taking away their choices when, when, you, when you violate them like that. Now, witness testimony will continue tomorrow morning. Flowers has also been indicted on new charges for allegedly sexually abusing another boy from his church. That trial date has not been set. Live in the newsroom, Angela Hong, 13 Wham News. All right, thank you, Angela. Tonight